is the Gardner Expressway taking blame for what dump trucks are leaving behind? That's a possibility, according to Toronto police, who say that about 75% of reports for concrete falling from the expressway involve concrete that never came from the Gardner at all. The city has a construction boom. There are sites that are excavating continuously to bring the material out. And police say some of that material is behind some concrete close calls under the Gardner. Since 2012, 86 cases of falling concrete have been reported to police. In 22 of those cases, it was confirmed the concrete came from the Gardner. But in 64 of those incidents, testing determined the concrete came from another source. It's not clear where most of that material came from, but police say in seven cases, the concrete was determined to have come off the back of a truck. Quite often our heavy truck uh, uh, officers are finding that these vehicles are overloaded by several tons. Well, it's hard on the infrastructure. It's now dangerous for the public. And there's a responsibility on the drivers and the loaders to load those vehicles properly. The president of the Ontario Dump Truck Association agrees. Baljeet Goriel tells City News overloading has been an issue for years. There's even a message on the homepage of their website pertaining to it. He claims drivers are often told to take the loads they're given regardless of weight or they will be at risk of losing future work. I honestly don't believe it's chronic in the industry. John Mullenhauer is the president of the Ontario Construction Association. He says it's likely a few offenders who are making overloading appear to be a bigger issue than it is. We're all looking f to optimize productivity, but we're balancing that with a, uh, a sense of urgency about, about working safely. The Dump Truck Association says it's asked the province for help to beef up enforcement and to hold construction companies more accountable. The Ministry of Transportation says that since 2012, just over 1,600 vehicles have been charged with being overweight in the province, and they tell us that they're working with the industry to improve safety protocols. Police say the other problem with overloading trucks is that it can cause an imbalance in the vehicle itself, and that can also lead to more collisions out on the roads. On Bathurst, Tammy Sutherland, City News.